Hi my gardening friends, I'm Lark and I'm in Wisconsin Zone 5 and I just finished digging up my potatoes. Here is the finished product of the compost where I grew my potatoes. It is awesome. So I'll cover it up and let it winter here and I'll use it in my containers in that bog area there for next year. Awesome finished compost. I found about, I'd say, eight rotten small potatoes. I don't know what causes that, that some would rot and some don't. Maybe you can let me know. But overall, I got a nice crop. It's not going to get me through the whole winter, but it is nice. Here I planted three organic red potatoes, and they were probably, they were on the smaller side because they were on the bottom of my, uh, they were about this size here, maybe this size, one of the two. And I planted three of those and I got, it looks like about, I'd say six pounds. Then I planted in the same pile, I planted uh, these yellow potatoes, that's what they were marked on the bag, organic at my organic grocery store and they were about this size kind of little you know compared to a baking size and I planted let's see how many of those I planted six and I got it looks like 12 pounds I'd say I'm judging from my 10 pound bag I'd say probably about 12 pounds so that's pretty good I'm happy. Now, I have to find out, do I wash these? They've been sitting in the compost pile, not growing, probably for about two weeks. And when I brushed the dirt off, or some of the dirt off, it seemed to come off pretty easy without taking any skin. So can you tell me what I should do to clean these up? Just brush the dirt off, or do I wash them and then dry them on a screen for a while? I can Google it, but maybe some of you can let me know right away. I took that in the first part of my potato harvest. I found that comfrey plant, and I took it and I planted it right here. That little comfrey plant. So I'll be covering this one up and save this beautiful, beautiful compost for next year. And I will be growing potatoes in a compost pile again next year, right there. That'll be the compost uh, growing, potato growing pile. And I will plant them probably, I think I planted them in April. And then I put this fencing around it to help keep the compost in. So I'll do it again, maybe two piles, I don't know. I got two nice sized piles of compost going right now and I'm thinking with fall and garden cleanup, I'll have a total of probably five compost piles, four new ones, and then this one here where I grew the potatoes. So I'm lucky lady that I have the uh, land and area to do this organic composting. So take care my friends. My harvest was quite successful for me and doing it the first time in a compost pile. I thank you, Patrick, from One Yard Revolution for motivating me to uh, grow it in a compost pile. It worked out great. Didn't have to water it. Uh, I don't, maybe, maybe I watered it twice. I'm not sure, but it stays pretty moist down here. So thanks again, you guys. Bye-bye.